Hello Pisces, this is your reading for the 4th through the 5th. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome to the channel. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe guys. Ooh, Ace of Cups there. Hmm. <clears throat> A lot of you guys are just, you know, very compassionate I feel. Um, you take others feelings into consideration loving yourself here getting your confidence up I'm trying to put that in the view of the camera I'm somewhere else right now so let's see what else is going on for you guys here maybe a new love interest somebody you're interested in hmm Mm, I think this is all about you guys right now um, feeling in your element and loving yourself you know this this is all about not letting anyone interfere with your happiness is what I'm getting right here um, you know you take care of the people who you feel like are there for you um, this is not extending your energy to anybody that you feel like uh, they're not doing the same for you okay very confident um, feeling feeling very very confident right now I like it not letting not letting allowing anyone to step on your toes okay oh yeah you've got new stars all around you and doing this I feel like there there's something that you guys are doing that's going to bring you abundance um, uh, financial windfall maybe some of you have actually started a business something that you feel very passionate about where you are helping people even um, but this is going to bring you um, financial stability if you're already financially stable it's gonna bring you even more financial security okay that's what I'm getting here I feel like there's also someone that is wanting to start over with you guys so keep that in mind that you might not even know or see somebody that felt like um, you know brought you a lot of heartache in the past okay now they're heartbroken there's there's something about what's going on currently all of those cars let's see what we've got here Look at, I'm just going to put them here and then we'll talk about them. Okay, the strength. Yeah, look at that. Loving yourself. Loving yourself. Here you come as well as the Queen of Pentacles. Okay. With, on top of the Ace of Pentacles. There's something financial that you guys have um, started, that you're involved in, that's really going to be very beneficial for you as well as your family. Because I get that you guys have a family as well. Okay. But in starting in starting whatever it is that you've started, um, you know, going down this financial road, I feel like there's somebody else that's like peeping, you know, what you're doing, peeping out what you're doing, okay? And there's something that they've realized about you that is very appealing, very attracted, okay? They realize that you've got your shit together. And now, you know, this person probably has always loved you, but is being highlighted at this point. There's something that's being highlighted about you and the love that you guys share. Okay. And I feel like this is somebody that you still love as well. And for some of you, this is a brand new relationship that you guys are choosing. And you may know about another person that is interested in you, but you're choosing not to go that path. You're choosing something else or someone else. Okay. But um, there is definitely somebody that is interested in you. And you share the same feeling. Okay. Then we have judgment here. Ooh, yeah. I feel like a lot of you for this past relationship, you know, you're, you're choosing to let it go. Choosing, you know, deciding that this is not what's best for you. That it's probably best for you to start over. Best for you to be with someone else. You're choosing to be the best you right now. Okay? You're hearing a calling. And I feel like this calling that you are, and you're currently doing, whatever it is that you're doing right now, I feel like you guys are on the right path, is what I'm getting here. Scorpio energy. Um, but there's somebody I feel like you're going to have to make a decision about here, if you haven't already. If you haven't already, guys, there's somebody from your past here. Somebody that you feel very, very connected with. Very connected with. There, There's coming a decision that needs to be made okay and I feel like 
you are so very drawn to this person, Gemini, Cancer, Scorpio, um, Aquarius, Leo maybe, but um, and any other earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, energy. But there's somebody you feel very attracted to. I feel like this may be like, you know, a, a twin relationship that is very interested in, um, you know, doing this again with you. I just don't know if you're interested in it. I feel like you definitely care about this person. I feel like you definitely feel the draw to this person. Um, but I don't really know if you are interested in doing this again. Okay, because I think at this point you're mo more focused on like, w you know, whatever it is that you've started outside of this, this connection with this person. Like, I feel like you're choosing yourself here. I feel like you will choose yourself here. Instead of this individual. Yeah, you guys are wrapping something up. You're wrapping up a cycle with um, a certain individual. And you're going into a new cycle, um, could very well be with the same individual, does not have to be. But the point of the matter is, you guys are moving on, this new cycle I feel like that you're going into, it's going to be very abundant for you, it's going to be beneficial for you. Things are moving in your favor right now, Pisces, most definitely. Maybe a new love interest for some of you. Like I said, um, not choosing a, a past person, moving on to someone else that you feel very drawn and attracted to, that you're very excited about even, that's very excited about you. But somebody is definitely, I feel, wanting to um, get back after they broke your heart. Okay? For sure. Alright guys, so that is what I have for you and I will be speaking with you soon.